Hey everybody, Carbrain Suits with you. Welcome. We're going to do uh, 2018 Bowman number 24 right now. Alright, doing alright. Ready to go home and get in bed. Honestly, wish it was not as late as it was. Because I would watch... Uh, Watch something on the Netflix or Crunchyroll. I've looked at uh, I looked at uh, your stuff that you recommended, Yomi, and none of it is on Netflix. So I think I'm gonna bite the bullet and uh, get a uh, uh, Crunchyroll subscription so I can watch it on there without the hassle of uh, commercials and whatnot. I think it's like seven bucks a month or something. It's, 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 it's worth it. But they all look good. All the ones I looked at look good. So I'm I'm, I'm willing to to do it. Yeah, Jesse used to have a like a log. You used to let me log into his, but he has since like I don't know if he canceled it or changed his password, and I don't really want to ask him for it. So I think I, I just uh, get my own. Norman, this is number twenty-four. Bowman, number twenty-four. And if I bother to get the crunchy roll, I'll be able to finish up uh, ship it in two, which I've been not been good about finishing. Not well, Norman, that's what I'm here for. I'm here to answer questions and to pull hotness. And now that I have answered your question, my only further goal is to get the hotness. That's uh, it's, it's first on my list. Like I, I'll probably I will probably start it tomorrow because I should be uh, I mean I, I will be free tomorrow. You know what I did I left that thing here. Let me drop. Yeah, I've watched a couple more episodes of uh, Soul Eater that uh, Jesse recommended, and I mean it's not it's not bad. It's just like it's a little bit too cute for me. Like I don't, I don't know. I just like I mean, like I think I discussed with you, you know, yesterday. I just don't want something a little, a little bit darker. I'll probably still finish Soul Eater because I think it's only like two seasons. But definitely looking forward to the uh, my hero. Yeah, I mean, again, it's cute, you know. Like, I mean, there's the. It's the the battle scenes are good, but you got to watch, you know, two and a half episodes to get to one, kind of. And, and a couple of the characters are kind of annoying, like.
No, I listen. I be I believe you, Yomi. I be I absolutely believe you. I am legitimately looking forward to get getting started with it. I mean, that's the whole that's the whole point. I think that I'm just gonna go like with the Crunchyroll Premium to not have to sit through the commercials and all that other bullshit. For I mean, what I, what I think is like. It's, Seriously, one one piece is one that I asked Jesse about. I I have known of it forever. I've just never watched it. And when I asked, like after I finished, uh, like I finished Full Metal Alchemist, and then I asked Jesse, like, "Oh, you got any recommendations?" And that's when he told me the Kill La Kill, which I'd watched and, and seen. And the uh, Gurren Logan, which I'd watched and seen, and then the other two, the uh, Death Note and uh, Soul Eater. Then, like, I just randomly asked him, was like, "Hey, uh, have you seen like any One Piece?" Only because, like, I like again, because I'd known of it. John, have a good one. And he, like, when he answered my text, he laughed at me. He was like, oh, I'm watching it now. So, I mean, I, I, mean, I know there's, like, a turd ton of episodes. Bowen for the night. This at least this brings me a little bit of excitement. Damn, eight hundred episodes, son of a bitch. See, I mean, I'm I'm okay with that. Like, I got time. You know, like I'm not since the since my wife's parents got got her that iPad for uh, for uh, her birthday. Like, I've been watching a lot of stuff. Okay, see that's that I'm I'm definitely John. This is uh, number twenty four. This is number twenty four. That's what I like so much about Naruto. Like over the years, is like it, it just kind of grew. Like grew into me almost. Drinking water? <sighs> and let's finish number twenty four. And uh, Yomi, if uh, I mean if you're around tomorrow, Jesse is on. Jesse will be on tomorrow, like same time, like six to two or three in the morning. And uh, I mean, he he loves that stuff too. Like he, he's a he, he's a lot of fun to talk to. He's younger, you know, more exciting. You know, I'm old a little bit, uh, a little bit more on the chill side, but he he's a lot of fun. He's a lot of fun to chat with. Now that uh, teal shimmer is on its way for uh, Kyle Cody to one twenty five of the Rangers. I hate the color teal. I absolutely hate it. 
I had a, uh, a girlfriend in high school that uh, that wore it, all it, it, it loved it, and it just, I don't know, I no longer enjoy the color. Not sure that, not sure that, how I, how I felt about it uh, before, but I don't like it now. Bad memories. Yeah, Jesse is a is a basketball and football fan too. So he's he's fun to uh, chat with about that. Uh, Corbin Burns, Atomic for the Brewers. Man, I don't know. I mean, the whole thing is just like this messed up. I mean, I mean, I guess I don't. Know. It's not even so much as her, but just like me and how I acted in in high school over over some things that just makes me cringe. Like, I mean, I was such an asshole. Joey Wentz, Braves autograph. I mean, oh, oh, yeah, well, at one point, like over the period of like six months, like I, I, I mean, legit dicked over like four people, four ladies, for no reason. Chatham to uh, two fifty. That is uh, Red Sox. Uh, Garcia, White Sox to two fifty. Paper. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean, I guess it happens to all of us. Like nobody's completely proud of everything they've done their entire life. Shit is what it is. You just have to learn from it and move on. Ryan McMahon, Colorado Rockies rookie autograph. AJ Puck, uh, Atomic for the A's. Go Gators. And a Dennis Santana. Refractor autograph. First Bowman for the Dodgers. That is a 37 out of 499. Uh, not really. I mean, that's, I mean, I, I don't, I mean, I'm going to be here until hella late, so I won't be up until like mid-afternoon tomorrow. I will probably cook dinner. I just don't know what it's going to be, and I will have to go buy stuff for it. But I like to cook. I consider myself a very competent cook so whatever i do for the for the lady i think she'll enjoy it may i uh, maybe risotto i know she's uh maybe some risotto and breaded chicken i know she i know she uh likes that we'll see michael yes this is number 24 this is number 24 and ona padres orange shimmer to uh 25 I don't know. See now, like now, I feel bad. Like I should have done like more stuff since it, since it is like my wife's first Mother's Day. But I, there's not a whole lot I can do about it now, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna have to roll with it. 
Uh, Chris Rodriguez, Angels to uh, 125. I mean, her mom will be around because her parents like come see the baby every day. Like I don't, I don't think there's a there is a day since that girl has been born that they have not seen her. And I don't blame them because she's like the prettiest thing that's ever been born. Gavin Lavalle to uh, 4.99 for the Reds. Uh, no, man. We're we're. I mean, we're already three autographs in. We had a Joey Wentz for the Braves, a uh, Ryan McMahon rookie auto for the Rockies, and a Dennis Santana uh, Dodgers refractor autograph. We've got a, a talent pipeline to uh, 25 for the Royals. So we still, I mean, we've basically got one autograph left. I mean, I know I told you, but I will do. I will do the uh, do a recap when this is over. Bottom of the twelve twins, five angels, three. Sounds like the Twinkies are gonna get get a victory out of this one. Only what, is, what there's only uh, what like two hundred and eighty seven more baseball games to play. Yomi it. Is she an, I mean, do you like, is, it, okay. How is she as a person? I mean, because that, in the long term, like, yeah, I mean, you can look at a tight booty all day long, but you can't talk to a tight booty. You gotta... If she is like spot on with like the things that you are interest, interested in, the ways that you see things about, then to me that means more than what she necessarily looks like. Medina to two to fifty paper. Not that it looks not not that it looks don't matter because they absolutely do. But there is a, I think there's people under underestimate the ability to like just be able to hang out with somebody like if you can just chill with somebody i mean that's it's it's huge or or huge oh come on stacy you don't think so cove soccer agrees I mean, look at me. I'm not a looker, but uh, I have the uh, personality of a GD saint. All right, see ya. Cove Soccer. I mean, Cove Soccer says, quote, My wife had a tight booty. Not anymore, but love her the same. I mean, and that's it. It's listen. As you get older, looks are going to fade one way or the other. Like there's, it's, you know, it, it, that's not sticking around. That is not sticking around. Personality, you know, companionship, talkability. That that remains. Daniel Johnson, four ninety nine refractor for the Nationals. <laughs> well yeah i mean the, the acevedo then i mean don't you know don't promise marriage or anything but you know hang out with her fuck it cousins to uh 75 
for the Phillies, gold style. Kaboom to 150. Now, I mean, if she likes straight up fugly, and, you, and, and I mean, you're not, you know, not down with it that way, then don't bother, but, you know, I mean, if she got a little something, something, but to me, personality is, is, is in the long run more important than, than the looks. But you I mean your lady gotta be good. Your lady gotta be hot either way. I mean it's not. You can't you can't have like some you know some uggo or something with it with a good person. There is a ratio. Now, I've tried to explain this to my wife many times. Like there is a ratio of like you know looks to personality that uh, fluctuates. Like I mean, if you are the hottest person on the planet that has ever existed. It floats one way. You can have a lesser personality. If you have like the best personality that's ever been born on this planet, then you can be super ugly too, and it's cool. So it's you know it, it's a floating scale in my mind. <laughs> Co soccer, you, bro, you're telling me, man. I used to weigh 170 pounds. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, back in the day, I had, I was the one that had that tight bod. I ain't got it no more. But the wife still loves me, <laughs> as far as I know. Ooh, orange autograph for coming up for the Colorado Rockies. A Colton Welker. Well, I mean, Yomi, then, I mean, listen, be happy. She's not the only, she's not the only lady on earth. If you ain't, if you ain't down with it, you ain't down with it. There ain't nothing, there's nothing wrong with that. You don't have to feel pressured to to be with some lady just because just because she like you. Uh, Junior Fernandez, Cardinals, Atomic. I mean, do you, my friend? At the at the end of the day, you are the one that has to be happy. That is that is an absolute truth. Clayton Kershaw at 499 for the Dodgers blue paper. And don't let anybody tell you any different. Once you get once you get uh, as old as my decrepit ass, you'll understand. Uh, Blue Refractor, Spencer Howard to uh, 150 for the Phillies. Just, you know, uh, as, my, as my therapist uh, likes to tell me, my feelings are valid. You know, and so are yours. Your, all of your feelings are valid. Every, and I'm talking about everybody, not just, uh, not just Yomi. Everybody, your feelings are valid. Don't let anybody tell you that they're not. Justin Dunn to two to four ninety nine blue paper. If you feel some way, you feel some way. That's it. All right, we're talking uh, Rockies orange refractor autograph. Colton Welker, a Dennis Santana refractor autograph for the Dodgers. First Bowman, Ryan McMahon rookie autograph for the Rockies. And a Joey Wentz for the Braves autograph. Thank you, everybody. We'll get this right to you.